What's going on YouTube? It's your buddy Will from the What's Up in the Sky 37 channel. We're online at www.whatsupinthesky.com. It's been a little while. I've had this head cold and uh, it's finally going away. Yesterday, uh, Kim came down, the new girlfriend. She's a hottie. But uh, I haven't had a chance to make any videos. <laughs> it's so crazy. I get emails on Facebook all the time. If you're on my Facebook page, you want to join me on Facebook, it's uh, facebook.com forward slash Will Farrar. Just uh, check the link. I think it's up. In, it's in my description. Um, I'll put it in every one. But uh, we're looking at Curiosity. I've been watching this stuff unfold about the uh, light on Mars, what NASA said about it. I think I might do another video just on that. But this, uh, these new sols that are coming back are really starting to – they're getting good. I tell you what, as we're getting close, I think we're getting really close to the uh, – I mean, okay. Just – this is – this is what, 595? This is the – right as of right now, this is like the third – third day ago on the rover right now if we go back and I'm looking at the top let me show you what I'm looking at. I'm looking at the top of this picture here and, and you I'm looking at this circle perfect circle here along with these two things down here um, as well as just the, the symmetry in these blocks and as we go over you're gonna it's just too cool this looks like a circle that's been cut out I mean it looks like it's been cut out with some sort of saw or something I mean it's been chiseled out of there that's definitely it looks like a perfect circle too um, there's little things up here then we've got this strange looking carving thing right here that looks like it's a face of some sort um, this thing here kind of looks like a uh, weird animal it's even colored off different but as we keep going check this stuff out I'm telling you it gets better and better um, this to me looks like it's been manufactured all this does and this is just so let me uh, let me see if I've got the uh, that's the actual, there it is, get my tools back, so I get the pointer. Um, but this stuff out here looks interesting, but if you keep going over from this, there's more like stuff that goes up. Up here, it looks like there was something interesting. Uh, it's hard to kind of see at this, but if you back it out, you can see it better. This has a, a carving in it too, almost like this circle up here, but it's more of like a face shape. It almost looks like a Bart Simpson type face, but almost... Uh, looks like it's patterned. It's not a face. You know, it just has that kind of shape to it. And as you can see, there's little patterns down here. It's something that's coming out of here. It almost looks like something's flowing out of here. See this right here? Um, like something's moving. Like this is an actual being or something. Something up there living maybe or water flowing out of there. It's got to be. I mean, it's see-through, whatever it is. And it definitely looks like it's, it's there. Um, it seems to be casting a little bit of a shadow. But more and more, it looks like machinery and stuff like that. This whole picture is pretty, pretty interesting. So this is from 595. I just pulled this up a couple minutes ago and was looking through it. I mean, look at this stuff up here. And it's blurry. No, granted, I know it's blurry. If you're looking at it on a phone or something, it, it might look real bad. But, I mean, look at the shapes and stuff in here. And you can tell that NASA's done their, their blinds effects on a lot of it. But um, it's getting harder and harder for people, normal people that come look at this stuff and they see the blurring and they see what's been done to the pictures and uh, they see these shapes and stuff like that. And it's, it's funny, I'm getting more and more people that are emailing me and saying, uh, hey, <laughs> what's going on? Like actually, I don't think I ever said, I was, I, was, I was getting towards this, but I had someone email the other day and said, yeah, you haven't had a video for two, three days. I'm uh, going through withdrawal. And that was just cool. You know, to me, that's awesome. But see how this stuff looks to be intentionally blurred out? And when I say that, see how the blur tool is used heavy right there? It just looks like it's done heavy. Right here is what was blurred out here. You can see the blocks. And I noticed when I've actually gone back and looked, and this seems to look, this looks like a machine of some sort. See, it looks like I've got these things that come down here, two things that come down. This is blurred heavily right here. Comes down, this comes down. There's uh, what seems to be one, two, three, four, five, six seven eight nine ten of these things that go up and there looks like they've got compartments to it and this is just i see what i see you see what you see you know this is one of those little guesses but look how it it seems to all be connected together and this comes down around the corner here very interesting my friends very interesting and it's uh more and more there's just cool look at this thing right here this is just the, the colors are interesting now this is I haven't even tweaked or done anything to this picture so let me show you where I got this from here it is right here the uh, actual picture you don't have to do you don't have to it's gonna be in the description so just go down to the description if you want to see it and uh, let's back this out and take a take a quick look at the bottom of this picture too because there's also some interesting stuff 
just uh, how these rocks seem to be just real smoothed out, which could be from the wind and everything too. So I'm not saying that's Martian made or anything along those lines. I'm just saying they're interesting. <laughs> like I said, the more and more I look at this stuff, it's it's just uh, it just looks like rubble. Something thrashed this whole civilization, took it out. I don't know if there's things still living up there too. A lot of people testify that they were. Uh, a lot of people say that there's stuff up there, they see it. I think that what happened, if there is anything up there, they're not the size of us. Maybe one time they were big, or bigger than they are, you know, a, a megalithic. They could build these big structures, and then they had a cataclysm. And I'm thinking, if anything, maybe a smaller race was able to, uh, because I keep hearing the Martians are real small, tiny. And that's why you see, uh, like, some of these big, huge blocks that have been worked on seem like they have little small carvings in them, almost like uh, they've been freshly done. A lot of the chops look freshly done on some of the pictures we've seen. This is interesting here. Look at this long piece. And then there's this right here. This kind of looks like the head of a statue just chopped off and rolled there. Which our eyes, you know, I always say our eyes see faces. We're, we're bound to see faces. But let me do the auto color like I like to do. Look at this thing right here. This is interesting. Let's see if we can't yank this out a little bit. See what the heck. See the symmetry in this thing? I know once I make it bigger like this, it'll probably just, uh, let's see, auto-tune, auto-contrast, whatever it is. Oops, sorry guys, don't want to make you sick. It's definitely got some interesting things rolling through it. Interesting colors, too. Look at the colors in it. You can just tell that this has been uh, two perfect circles right there. It almost looks like a piece to something, like it, it belongs to something else. Look at this over here, too. That's interesting. Back out a little bit. It's amazing once you actually put this stuff on. All this rubble here almost looks like... Uh, it doesn't look like just rubble I see when I go out, and I, I really do try. Because everybody always says, go to the mountains, go here, go there, look at this stuff. You'll see the shale, I see this. You'll, it looks exactly like that. And I try. I mean, I really do try. I take pictures and everything, and I try to see, you know, somewhere that's got this stuff like this just strewn about it. It looks like stuff, but because when, when you get in close to this stuff, it actually looks like, you know, parts of stuff that, you know, just machines, junk, you know, whatever. Let me see if we can't mess with the gamma. And, it, and that's when you really start seeing it. When I start hitting up the gamma, you're going to see it starts pulling the stuff out to where you can see some uh, some of the angles. Because what happens is, I, I swear the rovers are. are adding stuff to it that that just that color that they add to it seems to make it stuff just stick together it's hard to see the things but then when you start adding something like gamma that stuff starts pulling out and i it starts separating the things a little bit better let's see here then you get to see some of the artifacts that are up there like I said, I think there was definitely technologically advanced civilization up there at some point. I'm not sure how technologically advanced, but it was slightly beyond us. I mean, from what I've seen, some of the some of the stuff that you know, some of the architecture that I've seen up there that, that are in my videos. If you go back and watch my videos, I know so many of you have. Um, if you're watching this now. I really get, like I said, sometimes new subscribers come into the new videos, but usually it's uh, whenever like Scott Waring or something will put We'll uh, use one of my videos. That's when I start getting some new new people come in. But let's keep going through here. But see what I mean by how the rubble looks like there's stuff here. Let me hit OK and leave this. I'm gonna leave the gamma on for a second, and we're gonna roll through this for a second. So, but see this stuff like this looks like a perfect square, and it's got some stuff on top of it. It just looks like looks like a junkyard basically, and uh, definitely looks like a junkyard. Uncle Jake's junkyard. But up here, let's take a look at this stuff again with the gamma jacked up like it. Even up here, look at this cool stuff. See how, this is why I think it's some sort of machine or something that was over this way. Um, here, this thing right here. Because you can see all the compartments of it. It almost looks like uh, here, here, here. They're everywhere on that thing, whatever it is. And uh, this here, too, looks like it's got the blur. This would be much more, uh, if this didn't have this blur right through it, it would be much more apparent how much of a circle it is. But we can't tell. We don't get to see some perfect blocks there. And this stuff looks like it's in rubble. Oh, sorry, guys. What in the world? One of my mice are going crazy. No. 
And this stuff, like, people were like, oh, that's just normal shale. And then this looks like stuff that, would, like, tiles and stuff that came from something. This just doesn't look like normal uh, shale. I might be wrong. Said I, I've been wrong before. <laughs> I know that. So uh, surely not claiming to do anything scientific here, but just looking at it when you when you got this gamma up, how 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 everything looks like it's got patterns and stuff to it. Let's go back up to where I was looking at. This almost looks like a statue of a frog or something like that. You guys see that? I know someone else has to see that. But. All right. So I'm almost over this cold. I'm getting there. Put this thing on top of it. Look at the, uh, that's what I'm talking about, the, the symmetry of some of this stuff. It's just cool. Where's our circle thing? Our block. And this right here, I couldn't just figure out. I just kept thinking, what in the world is this right here? It almost looks see-through in a way, but it's not. See how it's rounded off? And it's got almost like this thing up at top. I wonder if I could, I guess I could if I did this and maybe, let's see what it looks like. You've got this circled back here, and it comes up into this piece like this. You got that circle, there's a circle there, and then uh, this thing just comes down like this, goes up, comes back, it's into here. I mean, but look at this thing here, it's like a, uh, that's what we can see, and now it actually goes down here too, and, and it comes up like that, but. You know, who knows what they built with and stuff up there. You know, it could, it's a totally different planet, so we can't just, you know, equate it to our stuff, but let me back out, hit step backwards. Oop. Let me use the keyboard for that. As it falls apart, hopefully you'll see a little bit better now. That's what I was thinking there, you know. And over here, look, there's more circles in here, more circles, little thing. But uh, this stuff here is what interests me the most. Because look how this looks like NASA used that blur tool and hid some stuff. And you've got this thing here. It seems to be the face of something. See that? As I pull it back. And then you've got these heavy blinds. I call them blinds. If you watch my videos, I call them blinds all the time. They look like they've been blurred out by NASA. So. And then over here, we got more stuff that looks to be standing. And just junk. Random junk. That's just laying around this planet. Something smashed this thing up pretty good. And I didn't even check this corner up here. More just with triangles, stuff like that. It looks like triangles. And more and more just seem to be patterns. Um, I mean, look at this right here. Ha! Look at the color change from here to here. This is supposed to be just a picture. It was never messed with. Tell me this doesn't look like something was hidden right here. Like something was taken out of this picture or something. And it might not have been, you know, it could just be the dirt up there. But to me, this looks awfully funky. This looks like some sort of machine or some sort of craft, but anyways, guys, let me know what you think below. Comment. Good to be back. Sorry I had to take a little break there. You know, you know how it goes. Every once in a while, I got to take a little break, but much love. Hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend. It is Friday night, 11 o'clock. I'm going to try and put this thing up tonight. You never know with YouTube how long. Sometimes this stuff bombs out when you're trying to upload it. And, uh... As I look through one more time, make sure I didn't miss anything. And I know I did, so comment below with the time if I missed something. Now, this cool thing here, I mean, let's go here. You know, I almost forgot to talk about this thing sticking out. Look how buried this thing is. Whatever it is, it just must be huge rock, which leads me to believe, look how much soil has been tossed around on the planet. Like, something happened. And you've got this uh, strange, look at this. It's just like the hook pattern there. I don't know, guys. You tell me. More and more I look at this stuff, this looks like just a wrecked planet. Something, like I said, and I've said that in a lot of my videos. Perfect little round thing there. Um, like, more and more, it was, looks like construction material. And i got buddies who send me stuff on here, like, that are, you know, are in construction. And they see some of this stuff, and they're like, whoa, that looks like the engineers, people like that email. But i got doctors that email me pictures. There's so many people that are into this. It's really starting to get take off, which is fascinating to me. And look here. You've got two perfect-looking same rocks. And usually Mother Nature doesn't make two of the same thing. But that looks like two pieces that are the exact same. Looks like some cross section pattern stuff down there this looks blurred out look look at the the paste the crap job nasa did on some of this stuff 
Now, if you go back and look at some of, like a lot of us, uh, I've been going back and looking at some of the earlier saws. Some of now they're actually downloading all the stuff that's starting to download. This was the one piece we were looking at earlier with the stuff on it. Go. Anyway, guys, much love to you all. Hope you had a good one. My name's Will. What's up in the sky? 37. Take it easy. Peace. 15 minutes. Not too bad. Not too bad.